what is going on guys and welcome to a brand new video and today we're going to be bringing you guys another merge arena video now i know i'm late to this because i was on holiday so there's a lot of new changes to the game and i'm very excited because all of these changes have been really good the best change for me has been the grand tournament this is absolutely fantastic the best thing in the game right now for you guys to be using the newest legendary cards and pretty much any new card in general and the gloves are pretty easy to get as well the recharge time is good and now i do understand that once the timer runs out you are playing up against bots but the whole purpose of this for me at least is for these players to be able to play with all these cards that they're not able to get that are very difficult to get or they just haven't had the luck to summon them you're also able to try new team compositions on your decks and that is also very important because you can do a lot of theory crafting and it's also not costing you anything that's absolutely free all you got to do is just use the gloves you get three and they recharge really quickly so it's honestly one of the best updates they've done to the game they've also updated the shop where there's a lot of things you can do you can watch some ads and get coins and there's also very cheap deals for you guys to get gems because the emeralds used to be quite expensive but now there's much better deals for you guys who like to spend money on the game i definitely would recommend there are some really sweet deals so definitely keep an eye out for those if you guys do want to spend some money on the game but by far i really enjoy this because i get to play with cards that i've never played before and it gets me really excited for me to unlock these cards for gems once that card becomes available to summon you're going to be a lot more excited because you know what the card does you know how strong it can be and you already have a really strong idea of what the team composition is going to be because you've already been playing with it now it's all rng based you kind of get to pick the cards but Every single time you're getting newer and newer cards, which is honestly very fun. And also you're able to grind these teeth, which is a new form of currency in this tournament basis. And you're able to get gold. You're able to get new cards. You're also able to get legendary cards, which is the best feature by far. Now, sure, it takes a lot of grinding, but at least you have the option to get these cards. This is what I was talking about in my last Mergerita video on changes that needed to be made. This is a very important change for the game because you are being rewarded as a player who is grinding the game. And that has always been very important in free to play games where the player will be in the game for the most amount of time grinding it out, but you're able to get legendary cards out of it. You're able to get some kind of really big reward that otherwise would cost you a lot of money. And if you are very lucky, because I've been spending a lot of emeralds and I haven't been getting the cards that I've wanted to, but this way I have a much better idea of what cards I really, really want and what cards Cards I definitely don't really care for and I don't want because they're not strong enough right now You also get to learn a lot about the game in general because you're playing with very weird team compositions And you're playing up against a lot of other weird team compositions So you're able to theory craft a lot in this game, which is very fun for those players that like to deep dive into deck building This is very nice You're able to try a lot of different units and you're able to do a lot of things you weren't able to do in this game I am super excited for the Mergerina team to have done this. This is definitely keeping me in the game for a lot longer than it used to before now i'm just grinding out these teeth so i can start getting legendaries that i didn't have before or upgrading other cards that i just didn't have the gold and i wasn't able to grind them quick enough that's another thing they've increased a lot of the gold that you're able to get out of each game and they've increased a lot of the rewards which is nice the shop is just a lot a lot better than it was before which makes me very excited because you're getting a lot more rewards you're getting a lot more cards for the money and it's just overall just such a better game fantastic overall i'm super excited to be playing this game more and more and they keep releasing a ton of cards that are super fresh super exciting to play and the character designs are honestly absolutely fantastic i'm a super big fan of the art style of merge arena so i definitely want to collect all these cards and i want to have them hopefully i'm lucky enough to be able to summon them but in the meantime I'm going to be playing Grand Tournament every single time. I'm going to be trying all these new team compositions. I'm going to be trying all these new cards out. And I will be releasing a video soon on which ones are the best cards up to now. There's a bunch of really cool cards like the Monkey King. That is such a very nice card. And it's super, super strong right now. So I definitely want to try the Monkey King with different cards in the deck as well. As I don't have that card currently. But in the Grand Tournament, I will be able to play the Monkey King once in a while. Because of the RNG. And once I am able to play the Monkey King, 
Monkey King, I will be able to do a lot of stats on it and I will be able to bring you guys much better content. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying the videos. Let me know in the comment section below if you guys are playing the Grand Tournament, if you guys are excited to be grinding this out, and if you guys are having a lot of fun with cards you just don't own, I would definitely like to know if this is the best patch for Merge Arena. For me, it definitely is. It's definitely very solid and it's pretty much the best addition they've added to the game so far. And the fact that you're able to use these teeth that you get, which isn't really difficult to get. It's not hard to win this. If you're a decent player, you can definitely win most of your games. And the games that are against bots are definitely a lot easier in my opinion. So you can definitely have a lot of fun while at the same time earning some type of currency and you're able to get gold and legendaries and certain cards from it, which is always going to be very rewarding and very nice for these free to play players than for these players who enjoy grinding the game. If you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like and a comment as it does help out the channel. I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching.